Hello, hello. All right, guys, as you can see right here, I got one blaster of select 2020. Uh, this is a great draft class, so I'm not going to sell this stuff. I'm going to go ahead and crack it. I did get a couple hangers. I had to go to about, I went to five total targets probably. Um, get a little bit here and a little bit there. It was one box per store. And they had so much of this stuff at all the stores. This stuff is, I don't know what, to people that's bought select in the past as just being hobby. Uh, this is not going to be short print, brother. This is <laughs> printing a lot of this stuff, and that's good and bad. Uh, it's good, but I think it may, I'm worried that it may drive down the price of the cards, the actual, like, rookie cards and stuff like that, because from what I'm seeing, there's going to be a lot of them. I hope there is in this box anyway. But uh, let me know how it is in your area, if it's making it more accessible, and how you like it, because I don't mind it. I mean, before I'd have to get up early, um, when I say early, I was getting to the targets probably like you know eight nine o'clock something like that when they open and you had to wait for the restocker to get there sometimes that might be 10 30 sometimes that might be 11 30 sometimes that might be noon and once you're already so invested in it you've been there since 11 30 like the hell with it i'm not leaving now especially if you know they got good stuff coming in there goes your whole day right down the crapper all right now it's like i can roll out of here at 8 30 um, get to the target 845, walk right in, walk up to the customer service, give me a box of select, give me that blaster right there. 15 minutes, I'm 15 minutes from my next target. Go to the next target, walk up there, get in line, let me get a box of select right there. Next target, boom, 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 boom. Just keep going to as many as you can until they start running out. I mean, it, it's, I don't mind it. I really don't. It, I'm done by 11. I'm back to the house by 1115. And I got a lot of blasters. I got a lot of cards. I can get one from each store, but I got a lot of targets in the area. So it's in transportation wise, it's not too bad getting around. All right, guys. So let me know how you think about it. I'm liking it. All right. Now let's get into this thing. I did open two uh, fat packs last week. I got off to a late start last week, man. Um, so that was all I select I had got last week. It was just two fat packs. But I, I, in my area, there weren't any blasters or hangers last week i think it was just just fat packs as it's this select stuff as a whole i'm not like ecstatic about it to be honest with you i mean i've seen better sets than this um optic being one um prism i think is I, i'm probably pretty close on the same car but we'll see give me the right cars and i'll love it right like the quality of some of the other ones out of the guy on the fat packs they're just like the streaks in them and just i don't know that and i don't like how like the players look on these cards like how the art is it looks cheap they look cheap you know they make it look all nice with all this stuff but i think the players itself they look kind of cheap so adam thielen and that's probably what a concourse that's that's the lowest one that's your field level, I'm I'm thinking right there. I, I'm pretty sure. And we got a CD Lamb rookie. That's the uh, insert, I think. Is it or not? Yeah, this is the field. It even tells you. It makes it easy, though, so that's kind of cool. Well, it tells you right there in the top corner, so field level. So I like that. That's great. Uh, so a CD Lamb. I think that is an insert. And then we got a uh, Tristan. Worfs? I don't even know what it's. Tripston Worfs. And it's a club level rookie. So, eh. It is what four cards per pack. We got a uh, Van Jes Jefferson. That looks like a regular concourse, and a Troy Palomalu. Right behind it, we got our CD Lamb Cowboys a die cut, and a Ben Roethlisberger Premier level. Remember the Premier levels were like like that shape right there. So we got a CD Lamb die cut. And then we got the CD Lamb insert as well. And this is a premier level die cut. And here 
here we got we got another die cut in this how many die cuts are you supposed to get i'm not a fan of die cut type stuff to be honest with you um tyler johnson we got an aaron Rodgers die cut that's an orange that's like a packer orange oh boy that might not be good for long it's premier level and here we got a Barry Sanders turbocharged. A turbocharged is a nice, pretty nice card. I think I got a Tom Brady turbocharged on my fat packs last week. And an AJ Dillon, that's a uh, premier, I believe, rookie for the Packers. Yep, premier level. AJ Dillon rookie. I got a lot of AJ Dillon stuff, man. Got a lot of it. We'll get down in the comments what kind of a luck you guys had out of this. What's your best pull, man? If you guys have cracked any of this, or like, while well, I watch videos, I'll watch them to see if I want to crack it. And I, the only reason why I'm cracking this instead of just flat out selling it is because of the fact that it's 2020 football class is great. And I see there's a lot of rookies involved. But then uh, that's the question I had. There's so many rookies. Is the market going to get watered down with them and they're not going to be worth anything or what? That's a concourse. Then we got the Tyler Johnson rookie concourse. A Jonathan Taylor die cut. What's this concourse prism? All the concourse prisms. And a Jacob Eason after that premier level. Jonathan uh, Taylor. And a Jacob Eason Colts club level. So nice one right there. There is a lot of stuff you could sleeve up on this. The centering is pretty bad. You can see that right there. That's pretty bad. Not even that. Look at that dent. Holy crap. I guess I don't need to sleeve this. Look at that crap. Oh my god. Are you serious? Yeah, Jesus. This one I'm talking about, man. I would not pay. I think the quality on these cards is subpar. I would not pay big money for these. Retail only. Because you could end up with something like that. Imagine if that wasn't a, a good Herbert. Oh my God. Throwing shit. <laughs> Tom Brady. Concourse. Ezekiel Elliott. It's like the same type of deal. Yep, concourse. And a hot star is Dak Prescott. Really? He's hot star? Really? Yeah? And look at that. Look at the hot star is Dak Prescott. Look at this. Oh, look at... What the hell? That came off, though. Alright. Well, that came off. Then we got a Baker Premier. A brownie, but. This is the last pack of this blaster. Wow, that Jacob Eason would have been nice. Even I'm looking at the bottom of it. Like the bottom of it right there. It's ate up, man. Jalen Rager. There's a nice field uh, select right there. Wrong player, though. Look at that. Josh Uche. And a Gabe Davis. That's nice. I like that one. That's a nice hit. A field level Josh Uche. I like this Gabe Davis. And a Michael Perrine premier. That's a concourse. Those are pretty nice cards right there. I like that. So, I mean, you can get some nice stuff out of this, but... 
I mean, these cards. God, there's like a scratch in that damn thing too. Look at this right here on on this side. I don't know. I can't get over it. It's like, man. Yeah, there is another one that's dinged up too. So maybe these singles will be worth something because the damage rate will be so high that I don't. Got a nice Jonathan Taylor die cut as well. Um, like I said, I'm not a huge fan of die cuts of any kind of any sport. I just don't like die cuts too much. So I'll probably be putting all those up for sale. I probably won't even like. I was putting going to put another together another lot, a next grading lot. Start putting stuff aside for that. But I don't know. I'll pick through here. Maybe I'll have something worth sending. And that Jacob Eason, I probably would have sent. But uh, I don't know. I have to see what one of these CD lambs are going for. I don't know other than that. All right, guys. I got two hangers. I'm going to go ahead and crack those. And hopefully I can uh, get cards that aren't, like, damaged. So, uh, all right, guys. Bye for now. And off to the hangers. Later.